Hi there. Hope all is well with you. You're having a great day. Hey, I want to talk to you about playing softly. You know, I have a lot of students that come to our camp and, and uh, you know, one thing I, I can say is I do get a lot of compliments about my technique. And I will tell you right now, one of the things that I've learned to do that I think is very helpful, and I tell people to do this too, is to play softly, okay? Let your amp do the work. So as a matter of fact, when you're first learning how to do this, turn your amp up till, and then it'll force you to play softly. When you play softly, your strokes are very little. They're small strokes. When I play soft, they're small strokes. If I play hard, see how much bigger the stroke is? Soft, hard. All right, so it only stands to reason if you want good tone, the harder you pick into this and dig in, the tone kind of goes out the window, depending on how your guitar is set up. If you pick hard, you have to raise the action. If you pick soft, you can lower it. Look at how big these strokes are. That sounds like crap. <laughs> this, with a light stroke, sounds good. Okay? Now, I can play with a light stroke. And then if I want to dig in, So I'm on my light stuff. I can I can be more expressive. It's almost like uh, you know a sac any anything any instrument blowing a little harder, hitting the piano key harder. Can you imagine if you're constantly hitting the piano keys really super hard, how hard it is to to play? Them? So same with guitar. The more energy you put into getting a note, the harder it is to play. So why not play soft? Now, I'll tell people to, to do shorter pick strokes and all that stuff, but really the key is just play soft. Turn your amp up and then play soft and you'll get shorter strokes. If you want to be more expressive and pick something harder. Then play soft. So, think about it. Experiment with that. Just play soft, okay? Again, the softer you play, the lower you can set that action, okay? Because if you dig into a low action, you're going to get a terrible sound. You don't pick so hard, you get a nicer sound. Okay? So, hey, hope this helps you. Let me know. Talk to you later. Hi, Rich here again. I just wanted to say thanks for watching. And if you liked it, hit the thumbs up button. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel so you can see all the guitar videos I put out each week. If you want more lessons right now, I have hundreds of them at guitarcollegelibrary.com. And if you want to learn jazz, hey, check out my course, Jazz Guitar Improv. You'll see the link in the description below. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you soon.